Now, here are your latest headlines and updated Kansas City forecast from KSHB 41 News. I'm Caitlin Canute with KSHB 41 News. Here's a look at your headlines this Thursday, November 4th. A movement is growing in Columbia, Missouri against the federal vaccine mandate. For the second week in a row, the sidewalk outside the 3M plant was full of employees protesting. This week, protesters came from even further away. In fact, one man traveled all the way from Florida. Some Republican lawmakers showed up to stand with protesters. Those lawmakers who were there said they plan to work on a bill to push back on the mandate. In less than a week, Kevin Strickland should know if he will be released from prison after more than 40 years behind bars. Strickland has been in prison nearly all his life and has maintained his innocence since the murders in 1978. This upcoming Monday, evidence will be heard in his case. Evidence his lawyers hope will overturn his conviction. A conference is happening to make sure attorneys from both sides have what they need for Monday. Jackson County Prosecutor Gene Peters Baker filed a motion back in August to overturn Strickland's conviction and set him free. Olathe police need your help identifying a suspect wanted in connection to an attempted kidnapping. Take a look at your screen. Officers are looking for this vehicle. We're told a man tried to grab a woman out of her car on Tuesday at the Olathe Medical Center around 7.30 p.m. The suspect's vehicle is a silver Chrysler PT Cruiser with a temporary license tag. If you see this car or know anything about it, please call the tips hotline 816-474-8477. Now here's Gary with the forecast. All right, high clouds on Friday, otherwise sunshine, a storm in the southeastern part of the country and a storm in the Pacific Northwest. But we are in the middle and it is looking fantastic. Our 10 day forecast, 58 degrees Friday, 68 on Saturday, Sunday, 71. And then maybe a storm in the middle of the week. Have a good night.